Ostrich versus Cassowary. Who would win a fight between these two giant birds? The ostrich is the largest and heaviest living bird. As its species name Camelus suggests, the ostrich was once known as the camel bird because of its long neck, prominent eyes, and sweeping eyelashes, as well as its jolting walk. Also like camels, the ostrich can tolerate high temperatures and go without water for long periods of time. The cassowary is a large flightless bird, one of the most dangerous birds in the world and the second largest bird on the planet. It belongs to a group of large flightless dinosaur birds known as ratites. It is closely related to the emu. What do they look like? The ostrich is the world's largest and heaviest bird. They have a significant weight, up to 320 pounds, 145 kilograms, and have a height of 9 feet, 2.7 meters tall, this making flight impossible. The ostrich is equipped with long, muscular legs built for running. Unlike other birds who have three or four toes, ostriches have only two toes on each foot, which allows for greater speed. They can sprint as fast as 43 miles per hour, 70 kilometers per hour, with a 4-inch, 10-centimeter talon on each foot. Their downward kicks can cause serious harm to potential predators. Males have bold black and white coloring that they use to attract females. Females, on the other hand, are light brown. The ostrich's eyes are 2 inches, 5 centimeters in diameter the largest of any land animal. Adult cassowaries can grow to an imposing 6.5 feet tall, 2 meters. In general, the sexes are fairly similar in appearance, though females are slightly larger and can weigh up to 176 pounds, 80 kilograms. Males can weigh up to 121 pounds, 55 kilograms. Like the emu and ostrich, the southern cassowary is a ratite, a large flightless bird with unusual feathers and other features that distinguish it from all other birds. A striking bird with glossy black plumage, the adult southern cassowary has a tall brown cask on top of its head, a vivid blue and purple neck, long drooping red wattles and amber eyes. The purpose of the tall helmet or cask is unknown, but it may indicate dominance and age as it continues to grow throughout life. Each heavy, well-muscled leg has three toes, with the inside toe bearing a large dagger-shaped claw, up to 4.7 inches long, 12 centimeters, used for scratching and fighting other birds. Where do they live? Ostriches live in the wild in western and eastern Africa, as well as South Africa. Once they roamed all over Africa, Asia, and the Arabian Peninsula. Now, due to being hunted so extensively, they are found only in sub-Saharan Africa. Ostriches farmed in Australia, New Mexico, and Israel have established feral populations. These birds live in savannas, semi-arid climates, deserts, and semi-deserts. Ostriches avoid forested areas. They use their keen eyesight to spot predators from a distance and run away before they can be caught. Areas with dense vegetation can obstruct escape routes for running birds. The cassowary's range is restricted to northeastern Australia, New Guinea, and the surrounding islands. Scientists are unsure if cassowaries were originally found on some of these islands or if the birds arrived there through trade with other native tribes. Cassowaries' preferred habitat is the dense rainforests of New Guinea and northern Australia. They use these humid forests to hide from potential predators and search for food in safety. They have been known to inhabit swamp forests, palm scrub, grassland, and savanna as well, though infrequently. What do they eat? 
Ostriches are carnivores, and they eat whatever is available in their habitat at that time of the year. They mostly eat plants, especially roots, leaves, and seeds, but they also munch on insects, snakes, lizards, or rodents that come within reach. When an ostrich eats, food is collected in the crop at the top of the throat until there is a large enough lump to slide down the throat. These big birds also swallow sand, pebbles, and small stones that help grind up food in the gizzard. Ostriches do not need to drink water since they get what they need from the plants they eat, although they drink if they come to a water hole. Cassowaries prefer fallen fruit but will eat small vertebrates, invertebrates, fungi, carrion, and plants. Cassowaries play an important role in maintaining the diversity of rainforest trees. Cassowaries are one of only a few fruit eaters that can disperse large rainforest fruits, and the only species that can carry large seeded fruits over long distances. They swallow the fruit whole, digesting the pulp and passing the seeds unharmed in large piles of dung, distributing them over large areas throughout the rainforest. Some rainforest seeds even require the southern cassowary digestive process to help them germinate. How do they behave? Ostriches live in flocks numbering 5 to 50 and are normally found alongside grazing animals such as antelope and zebras. During the breeding season of about five months, flocks will occupy territories extending 2 to 15 square kilometers. Outside the breeding season, smaller, looser flocks of 2 to 5 members form. Ostriches have a lifestyle which is nomadic and mostly diurnal, being active early in the day as well as late. Males are territorial, defending their territory aggressively. These birds like water and frequently take baths, if given the opportunity, and are good swimmers. Sometimes, to escape detection, they lie down with their necks outstretched, which probably was the origin of the myth that an ostrich buries its head in the sand. They use posture to threaten a rival or predator, fluffing up the feathers of their wings and hissing loudly. These birds are fast runners and usually will comfortably outrun their predators. Southern cassowaries are not able to fly, having very small wings. Instead, they use their strong legs for mobility and to defend themselves. If they are alarmed, they can crash through the forest at nearly 50 kilometers per hour, pushing vegetation out of their way with the bony casks on their heads. These birds are diurnal. They rest during the middle of the day, mainly foraging in the morning and late afternoon. They swim well and are good jumpers. Being solitary, they have a home range which they defend against other cassowaries. While in the forest, they make a very loud, deep territorial roar, which is able to be heard by others a significant distance away. Now it's time for the battle. Ostrich versus cassowary. Who would win? Ostriches are taller, bulkier, faster, and have practically the same weapon set as cassowaries. Even the biggest cassowary is smaller, slighter, and slower than the average ostrich. Both birds are primarily herbivorous, so no advantage there. Cassowaries sometimes eat rodents and frogs, but nothing anywhere near the size to give any advantage against an ostrich. The only real substantial asset of the cassowary is its claw, but even the ostrich has a nasty foot weapon of its own. And both birds use their weapon the same way, with a kick. And the cassowary will have a much shorter range than the ostrich, which will have far more strength and speed than the cassowary. The cassowary has a sharper claw, but that doesn't mean much when its opponent is bigger, stronger, faster, and carrying a similar weapon. Even the cassowaries are much more aggressive and have sharper beaks. In a fight to the death, if the adrenaline of the ostrich can reach a maximum level, I think its heavier weight will be the ultimate advantage. 
so I think the ostrich will win. What is your opinion? I'm waiting for the answer in the comments. That's all for today. Thank you so much for watching and please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button.